Ever wondered if humans could survive on a diet solely based on meat? Welcome to the carnivore diet. This intriguing eating plan has been making waves in the dietary world, promising a host of benefits from weight loss to improved health. But what exactly does it entail? Well, think of your daily greens, grains, and fruits. Now imagine cutting all of that out and feasting only on meat and animal products. Yes, you heard it right. The carnivore diet is a high-protein, low-carb diet that's all about meat, eggs, and dairy with not a vegetable or fruit in sight. It's a diet that's as primal as it gets, harking back to our ancestral days when hunting was the order of the day. But in a world where a balanced diet is touted as the key to health, could this all-meat diet be the secret to health and weight loss? Or is it just a fad? Time to delve into the meaty details. Why would someone switch to a diet that's all about meat? Let's chew on that question for a bit. We've all heard the claims. The carnivore diet is a one-way ticket to rapid weight loss. It sounds too to be true, right? But here's the catch. The carnivore diet is like the ultimate low-carb, high-protein plan. It's all about meat, eggs, and limited dairy products. No veggies, no fruits, no grains, just meat and more meat. Now here's why some folks are to this diet. One, they believe it can help shed those extra pounds faster than a cheetah chasing its prey. When you cut out carbs, your body starts to burn fat for fuel. That's the basic principle behind many low-carb diets. Two, there's the satiety factor. Ever noticed how a juicy steak can keep you feeling full for hours? That's because protein and fats, the two main components of the carnivore diet, are known to increase feelings of fullness. So, theoretically, you would eat less and still feel satisfied. And three, some believe the carnivore diet can help with certain medical there are stories floating around the internet about people with autoimmune disorders and digestive issues experiencing relief after switching to carnivore. But remember, these are anecdotal reports, not scientific evidence. So the carnivore diet sound like a dream come true for meat lovers. But what does science say about its benefits? If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more meaty content. The carnivore diet claims to have some toothsome benefits. Let's sink our teeth into them. This dietary approach, which might seem like a meat lover's dream, has been said to offer some potentially tantalizing rewards. First up, weight loss. Some proponents of the carnivore diet claim it can help shed pounds, and there's a kernel of truth in that. A diet high in protein and fat can increase feelings of fullness, reducing overall calorie intake. Of course, this isn't exclusive to carnivorous eating. Any diet that reduces calorie intake can lead to weight loss. But if you're a fan of feasting on filet mignon over forking up lettuce, this might sound appealing. Next, let's talk about blood sugar control. Some individuals with type 2 diabetes have reported improved blood sugar levels while on the carnivore diet. This could be due to the low-carb nature of the diet as carbs are the main nutrient that raises blood sugar. But remember folks, this isn't a one-size-fits-all solution, and it's critical to consult with a healthcare professional before making drastic changes to your diet, especially if you have a condition like diabetes. Finally, there are anecdotal reports of reduced inflammation and improved gut health among carnivore diet followers. Some individuals claim that by eliminating plant-based foods, they've reduced digestive issues and inflammation, but here's the catch. These reports are largely anecdotal and lack substantial scientific backing. They're intriguing, sure, but far from conclusive. So, while the carnivore diet does have its claimed benefits, it's important to remember that these are largely based on personal experiences and limited studies. The need for comprehensive, long-term research is clear. After all, just as you wouldn't buy a car based solely on the dealer's pitch without checking under the hood, you shouldn't dive into a diet based solely on testimonials without understanding its full implications. But hold your horses. Before you start grilling that steak, let's flip it over and look at the other side the potential drawbacks. Every diet has its drawbacks, and the carnivore diet is no exception. Let's carve into the less appetizing aspects. One of the most significant drawbacks of the carnivore diet is its extreme restriction. This diet eliminates essential nutrients found in fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. Imagine a life without the sweet crunch of an apple or the hearty satisfaction of a bowl of oatmeal, not to mention the rainbow of nutrients you're missing out on. This diet has a severe case of tunnel vision focusing solely on meat and animal products while neglecting the diverse array of other essential nutrients. Another potential downside is that this diet is high in saturated fat. Now, there's no denying that a juicy steak can be delicious, but the carnivore diet could turn that indulgence into a daily occurrence. 
This might increase the risk of heart disease, stroke, and certain types of cancer. So, while you're enjoying that ribeye, your arteries might be crying out for a break. Let's not forget the potential for micronutrient deficiencies. It's not just about vitamins and minerals. Fiber is also off the menu in the carnivore diet. Fiber is a crucial part of our diet, aiding in digestion and making us feel full. So, without it, you might find yourself feeling a bit, let's say, backed up. Lastly, there's the question of adherence. How easy is it to stick to a diet that only allows you to eat meat and animal products? It might sound like a meat lover's dream at first, but over time, the lack of variety can start to wear thin, not to mention the social implications. Picture this. You're at a friend's barbecue, and you can't touch the coleslaw, the potato salad, or even the buns for your burger. Now that's a tough sell. So, the carnivore diet is not exactly a walk in the park, but how does it stack up against a balanced diet? It's time for the showdown. Carnivore diet versus a balanced diet. Who's going to win this food fight? Picture this. On one side, we have our heavyweight champion, the carnivore diet. It's all about meat, meat, and more meat. It's like a barbecue party that never ends. Sounds tempting, right? But wait, before you get too carried away, let's introduce the challenger, the balanced diet. The balanced diet is like a colorful, vibrant buffet. It's got a bit of everything. Fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins, and yes, even some room for your favorite treats. It's about getting a wide range of nutrients that your body needs to function at its best. It's like the symphony that plays all the right notes, not just the bass drum. Now, sustainability and enjoyment are crucial factors here. Sure, a carnivore diet might seem exciting at first, but can you really say no to a juicy apple or a warm bowl of oatmeal forever? On the other hand, a balanced diet is like a marathon. It's not about speed, but endurance. It's about finding joy and satisfaction in eating a variety of foods, not just surviving on steaks and eggs. But don't think we're completely sidelining the carnivore diet here. There's no denying that focusing on quality meat can be a part of a balanced approach. Think of it as a guest star in your food show, not the only actor on the stage. So, after weighing the options, it appears the balanced diet might be the safer bet. It offers variety, sustainability, and a symphony of nutrients that the carnivore diet just can't match. But, hold your horses. This doesn't mean it's the only option out there. So a balanced diet seems to be a safer bet, but remember, the choice is always yours. It's been quite a meaty discussion. Let's wrap things up. We've chewed the fat over the carnivore diet, exploring its potential benefits like possible weight loss, increased satiety, and some anecdotal health benefits. But we've also uncovered the gristle, the drawbacks, that could pose significant health risks. This diet is extremely restrictive, potentially high in fat, and may lead to nutrient deficiencies. Before you decide to sink your teeth into this all-meat adventure, it's crucial to consult a healthcare professional. They can provide personalized guidance and ensure your diet supports your overall health and well-being. When it comes to nutrition, knowledge is power, and making informed decisions is key. Whether you're exploring the carnivore diet or any other eating plan, remember that your diet should cater to your individual needs, preferences, and lifestyle. So, let's put down the steak knife for a bit and pick up the paintbrush. Remember, the key to a healthy diet is balance, variety, and moderation. Now go and make your plate your canvas. And hey, if you enjoyed this meaty discussion, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more delicious content that will keep your plate as colorful as your lifestyle.